Hi, I'm Josh Hodges, personal injury attorney at the law firm of Kruger and Hodges in Hamilton, Ohio. I wanted to discuss today something that I've noticed since COVID-19 or because of COVID-19 within the personal injury space. Um, you know, 2020, we all know, craziest year I can remember of my life, uh, hands down. And, you know, everyone's staying at home more. A lot of people are working from home. And we all know that because of that, a lot of people are ordering, you know, from places like Amazon and the like and getting a lot of things delivered to their house. Um, because of that, there's more, you know, delivery trucks and delivery drivers on the road. So we could only have assumed and we kind of foresaw that there'd be more accidents with these type of vehicles. One thing that I would not have thought about that I have seen a small uptick, uptick in is dog bites. Dog bites suffered by delivery drivers for Amazon, uh, Uber Eats, DoorDash, places like that. So just kind of a public service announcement. If you own a dog and it's just running around the front yard, um, maybe when you weren't ordering all the time from these places, it wasn't a big deal. But if you're ordering and having things dropped off from Amazon, you know, multiple times a week, probably not the best idea just to have your dog uh, in the front yard. Um, if, if your dog bites somebody like a delivery driver when they're delivering at your house, um, you're going to be liable for that. And, uh, you know, we've got a couple cases like this right now. So I help people who are injured by dog bites. I mean, if you are a delivery driver and you get bit by a dog, I mean, obviously that's awful. Uh, give us a call. We can try to help you out. 513-894-3333. But I'd rather it just not happen. So, um, you know, 2020 is weird. It's just one other thing we kind of have to consider that we didn't before is that we might have more delivery drivers dropping stuff off at our house. And therefore, there's going to be more unexpected people coming through the front gate that the dog might not be used to. And we need to think ahead of time about that. Maybe keep it in the backyard or or if it's in the front, you need to be out there with it when it is. So hope that helps. Um, just something that, you know, I wouldn't have thought of and probably a lot of people wouldn't have thought of ahead of time that would be caused by, you know, everything that's happened in 2020. So, again, if you need help, give us a call 513-894-3333. Um, and hopefully you don't need our help. You can just uh, rectify it before it happens. Thanks.